you've turned on to rock and roll. <sighs> oh man, we are back on some falling in reverse. They did another like reimagined, like remix, whatever you want to call it, Revenge, like his own yeah. his own take on it. And this is Last Resort Papa Roach. Yeah. Like this is going to be very interesting. I don't know what to expect. Um, when I saw that there was a new thing that he dropped, I was like, wait, whoa, out of nowhere? Like, yeah. What, what, what's going on? And then I saw that it was Last Resort, and my first thought was, wow, he stole Papa Roach's name for a song? What did he write? <laughs> and and, <laughs> and uh, then everybody was talking about, like, no, like, Jacoby gave him yeah. know, his full blessing. You know, he loved what he did with it. Or I, I don't know, like, if Jacoby knew the full spectrum of what was happening, but... Guys, I know this took a long time to get to. We, we are, finally yeah. got here. Yeah, so, so just, yeah, here we are. So just It has been so painful to like, it has been in my YouTube feed <laughs> for like, like since it's been up. And I'm like, I can't click on it. YouTube so. feed and all of the comments <laughs> on all the social medias that you guys have been. My phone hasn't stopped. So. <laughs> I say, I, well, first of all, yeah, mom, what are you? Do you know anything about this song other than what we just played for you? You know, playing it earlier, or mm -hmm. no, no, okay, <laughs> no. well, yeah, we, she's gonna be I blind in this too. Away, yeah. we, okay, we only played Scouts her. Honor. We only played her the original song. That way, she knew what it was. And I think you were like, oh, this song. Mm -hmm. like, yeah. yeah, so yeah, that way she could just know what it sounded like originally to know what it sounds like now. So yep. why don't we just? I already go ahead. forgot. So yes. <laughs> that was. 20 minutes ago. <laughs> well, why don't we just go ahead and get into this one then? All right, let's do it. <laughs> Welcome back, you music junkies. I'm Eric. I'm the hip hop head. I'm Kyle. I'm the metal head. I'm Riker Road Mom. I begged shamelessly to be here tonight. <laughs> <laughs> and we're the family that reacts to shit, so let's do that. Tonight we have Falling in Reverse, Last Resort Reimagined. Let's get into this. Okay. Going like Inception? That's what I was thinking. Whoa. That suit, though. Is that some violin? Cut my life into pieces. This is my last resort. Suffocation, no breathing. Don't give a fuck if I cut my arm bleeding. Okay. I can't breathe. <laughs> so, oh. first of all... <laughs> This is amazing. Second of all, ha did you notice? I don't know if it has anything to do with it, but the visuals, it was crumbling beside him, yeah. the, the, the wall. Yeah. So that was interesting. And then the suit, spot on, but his voice. Mm -hmm. Okay, I have mm -hmm. to say something is that I am kind of a sucker for this voice out of Ronnie. Oh, I, I don't know if that's <laughs> odd oh, sounding, yeah. but like I really like that when he does something like this because yeah. we know what it originally sounds like, and that is not this. No. And this is awesome. Well, what do you think so far? I'm so happy. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, let's get back into this. So did you take it back already? No. Okay. This my last resort. Suffocation. No breathing. Don't give a fuck if I cut my arm. He's doing the guitar. This is my last resort. <sighs> Whoa. <gasps> Cut my life into pieces. Embrace my last resort. Suffocation, no breathing. Don't mm. give a fuck if I cut my arm bleeding. Do you even care if I die bleeding? Would it be wrong or it be right if I took my life? Mm. Oh my yeah, god! Run that shit <laughs> Okay, oh okay, my okay. God. Everybody stay calm! <laughs> <laughs> Nobody move! A fucking muscle. Uh, okay, 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 yeah. okay, let's go, let's go. Dude, 
this is I'm not a vampire meet, meets Papa Roach. Yeah. Feeding mm. on chaos and living in sin. Downward spiral, where do I begin? Ooh. Oh. It all started when I lost my mother. No love for myself and no love for another. To find a lover on a higher level. Finding nothing but questions and devils. Cause I'm losing my sight. Let's go. No, like man, okay, that again. I, I'm. I need to. I need to say something. Like, <laughs> how can you? Like, I understand that there is a big portion of the internet that does not like Ronnie. I get. Yeah. It. I, I understand. Like, everybody has their own opinions. But, dude, get, like, are we watching the same thing? Right. Like, Fuck like, them, it's, dude. So, so <laughs> it's. I agree. Jesus. It's just. It, this is. I have a lot of thoughts. I'm not going to bombard it. I'm just like, dude. This is. This is gorgeous. This is amazing. Bro, we still got two minutes. Oh, my God. Like, is, and what's weird uh, is that when he was starting up the piano part and everything, I'm so used to people doing, like, little covers on TikTok and things. Yeah. That when it kept going, I'm like, that's right. We get a full song. Right. It's just, right. Uh, isn't, but, that, isn't that sad? Yeah, I don't want to <laughs> I, I cut you off. No, no, no. Song. That's just like, no, I understand what you mean, where it's like, oh, my God, it's a full thing. So, okay. All right. Let's hear that again and finish this out. <laughs> Mom, do you got anything? Yeah, yeah, do you got anything to say? I'm just breathing. Okay. <laughs> I forgot she was here. <laughs> okay. I'll deal with you later. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. <laughs> what it was there it is they just end it <laughs> no <laughs> we're done no just oh my god um holy shit balls damn um just damn there's w what's interesting is that um Riker Rhodes started with a cover. It mm. started with um, Dirty Diana. With Dirty Diana, yeah. um, the weekend doing Dirty Diana, yep. and I remember going into that when before we even knew what reactions were gonna be like. And my first thought was, if you're gonna do this and cover the King of Pop, that's right. You need to do this right. And I'm telling you right now, Jacoby is one of my favorite vocalists that I grew up with. And really, he is just an animal on okay. stage. He, has yeah, so much passion and 
seeing Ronnie listen to this song and go, this is what I want to do with this. This was amazing. Like this was so fucking good. I'm, I, I'm, I'm sure. <laughs> like, I, uh, I'm, I'm really glad wow. that it went this, like you were saying, almost like that. I'm not a vampire style. Yeah. That's the one that, yeah. like, I, oddly enough, I don't listen to it a lot, but that is probably my favorite Falling in Reverse song. Mm. And he did the same style with this. And like I said earlier, where it's like, I'm kind of a sucker for that tone in him. Mm -hmm. And His low register just blew me <laughs> yeah, away. That was that was very interesting. But it's it even with when he mixes it with that higher, like that higher tone, it's just him being able to do all the things that he can do, it's amazing. But taking such a hard song, like he did not I don't mean hard, but like a hard ass song, and he turned it into mm -hmm. this. Yeah. Dude, how, you, that's making something that was so um like, I don't want to say guttural, but like so like like punk and like emo and like all this stuff. And he Grunge made it yeah, 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 and he made it beautiful. He's taking a taco and making it a steak. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, okay. What we if you put tacos. your hands with steak tacos? Ooh. Put your hands together. No. <laughs> now we're cooking with grease. But see, <laughs> but no, like that that's the thing, is that like being able to do that is amazing. And I I don't know. Maybe it is because of the whole background with mom and grandma and everything with the, the quartet and, you know, the barbershops and everything. But it's got that, like, it's got that sound, like, almost like, I dare say, haunting. Yeah. But it's yeah. just, I don't know. I'll just keep talking in circles about this because yeah. this was amazing. So, mom, it's yeah. your turn to talk. I recently heard Ronnie say in an interview that Queen is his favorite band. Okay. Mm. And, um, Ronnie, I can't hug you. But I want to tell you that Freddie Mercury would be proud. Oh, of agreed. You. He oh would be God, a yeah. fan. Agreed. And he would just be so damn proud of what you have done. Yes. Yeah. I'm proud of you. I'm just, I just, you're just one of my babies. Oh. I love <laughs> Jesus, this so Mom. much. Thanks for, where's, where's, thank, don't, <laughs> don't you dare mute me. <laughs> Man. I'll come out of this chair, <laughs> beat the shit out of you. Jesus, now, <laughs> guys, help me. <laughs> I'm curious. Um, do you, because there's something about the way that when somebody writes music and I think about how it could be applied to other things. Now, to be upfront, I'm not the biggest Beatles fan, but I do know that when they made the musical across the universe, it utilized all their songs that, oh. that they wrote. And okay. the, the story yeah. being told. What I'm getting at is, do you think that Ronnie would either be interested or would have the capability of writing the music for an epic, just like musical of just amazing yeah. proportions. Like it, that's all I could hear with this is because I remember us watching, I'm not a vampire. Granted, I had already seen it, but I was like, dude, I'm like, this feels like the finale to a big like yes. vampire play that's happening. But I can listen, even like listening to this. It feels like, no dude, this was the finale. So yeah, I can agree with that. And I don't like musicals and I don't like theater plays and I don't like things like that, but I understand what you mean. Mm -hmm. And I would yes. go see something like that. I would leave Amish country to go see him <laughs> do a rock opera in, in New York city. <laughs> and I'm waiting for that. So and I'm, on only, I'm only getting Get on it because I'm she's only not getting gonna older. Let up. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, this was amazing. Sorry oh, it took so long. So we I was gone. Kyle had to work. So we got on it as soon as we can. We clearly loved it. And remember. Eric told his kindergarten teacher on his first day of school that she had nice legs. And I got a phone call. <laughs> I just saw her the other day. So if you liked what you saw, you know what to do. You hit the like button and subscribe. That way you never miss an upload. And watch us two idiots react to stuff. Comment down below if you want to see anything else. Yes, comment we'll down below. We'll get you as soon as we can. And we'll see you next time. Cheers. Adios. I am so many emotions. Mrs. Britton. This is Judy. <laughs>